Let's take a look at capacitors. Here we have an electrolytic capacitor. It's rated at 400 volts AC, 50 to 60 hertz, 30 microfarads. This is very large. It's found in an air conditioning unit. Here found in a microwave oven, 7.5 microfarads, 60 hertz, 400 volts AC. Here we have smaller electrolytic capacitors there now. These are found in most printed circuit boards. Electrolytic capacitors are, have a polarity, negative and positive. It's very important to connect them in the circuit the correct way. Here we have ceramic type capacitors. No polarity, doesn't matter which way you connect them. And again, polyester type capacitors, doesn't matter which way you connect them round. OK, I'm going to take the capacitor there now and I'm going to supply a small current across the electrodes for a short period of time and give the capacitor a charge. A few seconds, we'll disconnect that. And now we'll take the multimeter, I'd like you to watch the scale, and we'll see how long that charge lasts for. Full scale deflection, and now it's gone. So what's the capacitor doing? It's holding a charge for a very short period of time and then it's releasing that charge when we need it. Now remembering from our studies what determines the characteristics of a capacitor, well first of all it's going to be the physical size of the capacitor, so the size of the plates. Then it's going to be the distance between the plates and then of course the type of dielectric used. Now what we're going to do with this capacitor is we're going to split it and have a look exactly uh, what's inside this. Now one of the things you should always make sure with a capacitor is, is it discharged? And you should always ensure a discharge. These capacitors here are rated 400 volts AC. If you were to put your hand inside of uh, the unit, the aircon unit where this is fitted, um, even though the aircon unit could be disconnected from the main supply, by touching, by putting your hand across these two electrodes here, you could actually kill yourself. So it's very, very important to ensure that when you look inside any kind of unit, be it a microwave oven, a television, uh, an aircon unit, where you see capacitors of this sort of size fitted, be careful, they are lethal. So we're going to take a hacksaw and quite simply we're just going to split this Okay, check it out. We've now got the capacitor in half. I've uh, got rid of the fluid that was inside and I'm going to pull the half out. And look what I've got. I've just got a big reel of plastic. And that's going to go on and on for many, many meters. And that really is all a capacitor is. And when you think that this thing here is really going to take a charge of about 400 volts, a few amps, could kill you. That's all you've got inside a capacitor. Now if you take a smaller capacitor, that's all that's going to be inside it, just a smaller version.